So we're on the site of the Japanese Christian Institute and Church uh, that uh, moved here in 1933. Um, and you have a picture of the original church uh, behind you on the wall there. And we all know with the uh, war in 1942 that this was actually a, um, a pickup point for Japanese Americans when they were taken from their homes and from their businesses and interred into camps. Uh, so it left a vacant building, really, and it was owned by the Christian Church Disciples of Christ and they still wanted to have a presence in the community. Uh, the community at that time was a, a multiracial community with African Americans, with uh, Chinese, Armenian, um, Mexican. At the end of the war, the Japanese returned uh, and they became a part of the church and a part of the community center so we have a little over 40 staff, uh, and that's why I say we're, we just represent uh, the group. Um, what I'm really proud about is out of that 40 staff, 40% 40 of the staff are either former program participants, interns, um, and I think that says a lot about what we want to foster is that we are always looking to hire from the community if we can, always looking to provide that opportunity. Well, you know what, actually, uh, <laughs> we're talking about being a second home. I mean, and I don't know if they know that, but I, I spend a few nights here in the building, you know, and, and she knows, like, Somehow, you know, it's like we work long hours and sometimes the weekends and whatever. But I can say that throughout the years, I spend maybe 12 nights, you know, not consecutively, but, you know, uh, there was a shower in the building. I mean, this is a place where you could just stay all night and work and get up in the morning. And, you know, so that's how close it is to, to a home, you know, I mean. I haven't heard anybody saying, oh yeah, I can sleep at my job, you know, or unless you work, you know, the night shift. What all people did for me was they saw the potential within. They saw the potential that I had and they helped to shape and continue to shape to this day who I've become and who I'm trying to become in the future. That's what all people has done for me. They have actually been a true support system apart from my family and my friends outside. I know I can always count on all peoples whether I'm here next year or whether I come back in 10 years. I know all peoples is a place that I will return to. It's a second home for me. It truly is. It's a second home. The name of all peoples came from um, the scriptures. I, Isaiah 5, 6, 7, it said, my house shall be a house of prayer for all peoples. Uh, which means that everyone here is welcome, regardless of anything. Everyone is welcome. Yeah.